Today me and my friend are doing brake pads on his girlfriend's car. I'm gonna record the whole thing, see if I can maybe make a video out of it. <clears throat> what year model's the car? 2017. 2017 Volvo S90. Got it? Yeah. Look at all the freaking rust dust on the wheels. I'm hoping it was just a bad set of brake pads is why they burned up so fast. These are pretty bad. Yep, there we go. Can't see, can't feel. Oh, got Allen bolts. Have we got any Allen wrenches? Yep, I'll go get them. Going on a tool run. Might rain on us. There's thunder over that way. Okay, uh, see if we can get away with something here. There's two different sets there. Uh, Maybe one of them will work. We need the short ones. There's no way I'm going to get any with the long ones. Sweet. Do I need to get a small extension? Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. I can't get on it. <laughs> All right. I'm up here trying to get him tools and it looks like he done got it. Did you get it? I don't know, man. I'm going to need to put it back on now. I'm good. That'll give me time to pull the stupid plastic plug out of this adapter. I mean, there's no material left. It's almost like the pad material just came off. How many miles did you say again? 60,000 miles. Zero pad material left on the inside pad. I mean, zero. Like, it looks like the brake pad material came completely off. Yeah, I mean, that's not good, dude. This is the counterpart. Plenty of material left. So either that it's like plenty, but it's, it's better than the either the pad material came off or uh this the sliders aren't moving. Uh, the sliders are moving. And it is the ones where you gotta actually rewind the bitches. Right. Well, that's okay, because I have that anyway. O'Reilly's advanced. AutoZone, I understand you guys want to protect yourselves and keep people from stealing stuff off the shelves, but this is ridiculous. I mean, I guess at least we know the script for next time. Where's that extension? Right there. Oh my fucking <clears throat> So that was a headache and a half. Uh, we couldn't get the caliper to retract all the way. We had to take the electric parking brake off the back side of it to then screw in the uh, the caliper the rest of the way. The actuator wouldn't come down. Mm-hmm. I should have recorded all that. Maybe we can do it on the other side. Yeah, but I'm going to have to do the same on the other side, so... Well, at least on the other side, we'll look like we know what we're doing. <laughs> yeah. Only upload one side. <laughs> Use this side as the blooper reel, right? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I hear thunder. Yeah. Coming from over there. Well, I was working today, but I don't think I'm going to be down. I will be, but probably just around here. I mean, that might be what I end up doing, is just working around here. Not <clears throat> I won't go any further. 
song, I say it is. I feel like it's probably only this side that's like that. I, well, I hope it's only this side that's like that, shall I say? Mm hmm. It's like, it's an option. It's going back on. I mean, it's supposed to be 103. I mean, it's better than the tire shop. The tire shop's going to dig a dig of it, so. You want to use that little short extension I brought out? No, I should be okay. No, of course. Great, now we get to do it all over again. Oh, thank you. We'll be back after a short five minute break. And we're back. Now we get to look like we know what we're doing. So to rephrase what I said earlier, a, a redneck and a Brit working on a Swedish car. <laughs> I'll just cut that other one out. <laughs> oh, gosh. Yeah. That glue's on one. Mm-hmm. He knows where I'm recording. Every time I move sides and I start recording, he moves, he moves his head. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's not your fault, you're trying to work. I was hoping, which is what I said to you this morning, that I didn't want to do these if it were going to rain, but I mean, it's held off well enough. Mm hmm. I wasn't getting wet. At least this side, we know we have an idea of what we need to do. Well, it was just this electronic parking brake, that's all. So, you got to take the par electronic park brake motor off so that you can spin the shaft to retract the parking brake the rest of the way. And then you can screw it all the way in. Okay. And as we learned, the pad with the clip on it goes on the inside, and the pad without the clip goes on the outside. Oh, don't forget your caps there. Did you put the other side back on? Uh, yeah. Oh, you slow that wheel over? <laughs> How hard do you want me to throw it? You ready to catch? No. I will let it hit a car and then you can explain. He said throw it! I promise. So I threw it. These are the original pups. Yeah, they still got the Volvo emblem on them. Alright, no you've all seen, us, seen a wheel put on before, so we need to start cleaning up before this rain hits. Since we had to take the... Um, 
electronic brake motors off we have to recalibrate so put on the brake hold the parking brake up and start the car and then keep holding it still holding it still holding it yeah we're going in all right so we should be good and then drop it off and then i'm just going to tap it one time turn the park brake off okay why didn't it do it Okay, it's making a liar out of me. There it goes. And we're good. We're just gonna hold it for a second, make sure we don't get any warnings. Because earlier when we tried to do the first one, it popped up and said, park brake not fully disengaged and through an error code. But we're good. Thank you for watching.